first thing you need to know about how storage of data will take place on the instrument and in your particular case I would advise that most of the time you use manual storage which means you make one measurement at one location and you press save that will store it into a store name that you've selected and will allocate a it will increment the file every time you press store go to manual mode must I press a button on the main screen to actually then save the readings or what uh, yes you must okay. press it's when shown. you you must uh, press start and stop okay. when you're in manual oh you must press start and stop yeah okay so, so you once start. you press start it will start recording and once you press um, stop for example if we demonstrate that quickly mm -hmm. we press start and mm -hmm. it will end automatically when one minute has passed, oh, when you see one the timer going away there. Yes. Or you can end it prematurely by just pressing stop. Stop button, okay. And it will only have collected 12 seconds of data and you can then decide. Okay, if now you it says save, save data and you press the middle button. If you say yes, then yes. increment. Uh, if you go to any other mode but manual, press enter. You go to auto store. And that gives you several options there in auto store. And auto store just runs the moment you press start, it runs automatically and it will record for a 10 minute interval. Every 100 milliseconds, it'll take a sample and it'll do an LEQ calculation. Again, each of these is programmable. So, so on auto store, if you leave the instrument for an hour in a location, it'll take 10 readings per second. So you'll have a whole lot of data, probably too much. Mm. You can, you know, then pick up events on your data um, over that hour. Mm. If you have the intervals set to uh, LEQ for um, one minute, then every minute you will have an LEQ reading. So in that one hour you'll have 60 LEQ readings, 60 mm. average readings. But you'll also have all the instantaneous value, okay. 10 times a second. 